I'm here to tell you why I support Colin Kaepernick's right to protest against saluting this American flag. 100 years ago, in 1916, Hubert Eves, my grandfather from Des Moines, Iowa, at 11 years old, was arrested for not saluting the flag in school. The judge sentenced them to nine years in jail. Can you believe that? They asked him why he wouldn't salute the flag. He simply replied, I'll salute the flag as the flag salutes me. You see, even at 11 years old, he had developed his own philosophy on American patriotism after reading and hearing stories. For example, soldiers that would come back from the war and talk about how they were disrespected, how they couldn't get jobs, and they fought for this country. He was aware of the injustices going on at the time, plus there was lynching. So his story made headline news in at least 15 newspapers that I know of and books. So let's fast forward to the year 1943, because that's when the law got changed. You no longer had to salute the flag in school. This young boy was unaware of how powerful his action and his statement would become. Let's fast forward again to 2016. Now, similar to my grandfather's bold statement in 1916, we now have Colin Kaepernick. He's making a bold statement by sitting down at standing flag ceremonies so he can call attention to the racial injustices against people of color today. Now, I'm not saying that I do not appreciate this country I do. Our country has always had the potential to be great, but I believe we have so much work to do. And with the polarization that we are witnessing today, we need to be working overtime. I applaud you, Colin. My father and I, and my grandfather from his grave would be proud of you. So we say, stay strong, brother. Peace. Thank you for listening to me. You can also find more detailed information by visiting HubertEvesIII.com.